Hey everybody, Ruben Cohen at Lurson Mastering, and today for Tech Tuesday, I want to talk about the Gullfoss plugin. This is a very unique plugin. Alan Meyerson actually turned us on to this years ago when it first came out, and I can speak to it as a mastering engineer using it on the master bus. I know a lot of people like using it on individual elements in the mix, but um, when I use it, although rarely, I like to use it very minimally on the, the source, the Pro Tools, before it hits the console. You'll see the parameters recover. That is to determine um, what is missing, what is masked in the frequency spectrum. Tame is something to figure out what has some resonance, maybe something that's too much in the frequency spectrum, and it looks ahead to try to tame those frequencies. The bias uh, determines what to prioritize, recover and tame. It only works when these are, when these are up or in use. Brighten is a general uh, brightening or darkening of the signal, and the boost can create either a smile or a frown face uh, curve on the signal. Uh, another cool feature is you can, you can pull up these gates on the frequency spectrum, so it only behaves where it's blue, not red, as kind of a filter roll off on how it behaves. You can even cross these over and do the opposite. So there you have it, Gullfoss, use it if you need to. It's very seductive, so it can seem like it works on everything, but just kind of uh, always have some hesitation in terms of how far you want to use it, or if at all. I use it very rarely, but when you need it, it's great.